hello there this is the simple video in which i am going to tell how do you how are you going to use uh, the git diff command so for that first list the all the directories on the windows as we are using the git on the windows that is the ls i am using the desktop that is the cd desktop so in that mkdr uh, ram git now enter into it that is the ram git now initialize with git so that we can perform the steps which is required for the git uh, in short we can say it is the short set of tools for the using git commands that is git and it now git has been initialized there git config global user name then my name that is the my party next now i have to use the email because these are the important environment variables so that it will able to give the credentials to who has committed and then uh, what are the changes so now i have completed the changes now uh, i am going to create one file with which we are playing for the gitd that is the vm vim ram.html So in this way, I have created the HTML. Now, uh, whatever you are uh, going to perform in the JIT, always remember the two commands that is the add and second one is the commit. So first, I will uh, make the JIT add ram.html. Next, JIT uh, commit dash m that is going to give the message that is the created ram.html. Now my message has been committed now i have to check the status what is the status jd status is going to show nothing to commit working date is clean so now we as we are going to uh, as we are going to see what are the changes are going to happen there with the diff command so bin ram.html so i'm now going to change the ram and get replaced with the shiv So it will be like this now i'm going to check uh, how the uh, what is the difference has been occurred in the same file with the git dev then head ram.html as you are able to see the driver indicates that this content has been removed and plus with the green color indicates that she has been added in this way git dev tools work simply Thanks for listening me and bearing my typing mistakes.